Welcome back to the Math Juice, where in my Math 8 courses we're going to be talking about bivariate statistics today. Um, so what we talked about last time, or what we previously learned about scatterplot diagrams, is gaps, clusters, outliers. So gaps were sections in data where we were missing information, where we expected things to be. Clusters were large um, groups of information that was all in one area, and then outliers were, were, were areas on the graph that laid outside of where we generally would predict them to be. Okay, we had types of linear correlations or relationships, and that was these right here, positive, negative, and then no association. Um, remember, linear means straight. And then interpreting individual individual data points. So just individual data points. They have an X and a Y generally. Okay, and then today we're going to be talking about extrapolate and intrapolate. So if we're looking at, a, and we'll explain that later, but generally the, the, the definition is extrapolate estimates and makes predictions using or outside of data point range. And then interpolate estimates and makes prediction based between data points. So interpolate is your gaps, um, estimating values in a gap. Extrapolate goes beyond the range, which would be your highest and lowest Y values or your highest and X, lowest X values. Okay. And then we're going to make in inferences based inferences based on bivariate data okay so let's go ahead and get started so I can use scatter plot diagram to make predictions on model situations using a linear function okay a line of fit is a line that closely follows the data points so we have our data points here and then we have a line of best fit that kind of follows through that. You probably heard me using that term um, before. But now we're actually getting the definition. So these are definitions you might want to write down. Interpolate is to use patterns to predict what lies between data points. So interpolate right here, we have a gap in our data. And we're interpolate is to estimate one of these given values based on the data points that are on that line of best fit. And then if you use patterns to predict what lies beyond the data points, it's extrapolate. So these are these are extrapolates. So we're looking at we're predicting outside of our normal range of our data. Okay. So interpolate generally is our gap within the range, and then extrapolate would be a gap outside of the range. Okay, so we'll go ahead and end that there, and then we'll start looking at some examples.